How to beat elite Brunarius boss in Blunt's Tower Defense 6? Well, in this guide, I'm gonna show you how to beat it, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Oh, one more thing. We need to use Benjamin for this. Definitely. Now we are up and running. Alright, let's see if we can beat it. Next thing we can start with is the minion. Yeah. But I have it right here. It's actually really simple, at least if you have double cash and you have all the monkey knowledge you need. Very simple and plain. I think you can do this without monkey knowledge as well. I'm not sure to be honest. I've never tested this. Not without uh, monkey knowledge. But in this video it will be with uh, monkey knowledge. Do it like this. Gonna have the farm right in the middle here because you're gonna have one farm around him. Just upgrade it like this. As you see, I'm just upgrading it uh, to 2 2 and we are upgrading 4 farms. Uh, that will be the same. 2 2 2 2 and 2 2. Like this. Next thing we're gonna do is to save up money for Speaking Bomb. I will see we're earning money really, really fast. Like this. Next thing I'm also gonna do is to get 10 of this druid. And you're gonna buy this and this. And you're gonna do it with 10, 10 plus. Get it in the correct spot. Like this. We need some money because of all the balloons that comes out of the balloonarius. I misclicked on that one. Now we have eight. We can also get the village in here. And we're gonna get the balloon strap as well. I will put it right here. Now we can upgrade it. So now it will basically go by itself. Right here. So you see we melting the boss really fast, this way. It's really OP, and it's worth building it, trust me, it's really worth it. Yeah, so it will be like this. Now we can upgrade all these farms, and we can build this now, and we're gonna get Two more. I'm gonna have them right there. Like this. And you see in the range here that we have space for two more. So that this will be the two last one we're gonna get. And next thing we're gonna do now is to save up enough money for the master bomber. I promise you, this is really, really strong versus uh, Blunaris. So you should absolutely go for it. I'm just placing myself right in the middle here. So it's much easier to see it. Like this. Next thing we're gonna do is to upgrade these two banana plantations. Like this. And we're gonna place this. Um, we're gonna get the top half on it. And bottom path. Next thing you can do is to get the MIB, and you can start to get. Also, first you're gonna get this guy in here, and now you can upgrade this on every single one of them. You can also start to upgrade the banana plantation as well. 
And if you feel for it, right in the middle of this, you can start upgrading. You should be good. You can also activate that ability to give you some more money as well. If you feel it's too sketchy with this, you can always upgrade the grid so you get more repairs damage like this. You're doing it in the middle of the round. It works perfectly fine. So now you get even more money. So yeah, it should be good. It should be good. I'm gonna make this simple as possible. Get this. Can we get the rest? Okay. And now we can continue upgrading these banana farms. 90,000. You see, it's 7 rounds more left. Now you can start upgrading uh, the marketplaces. And boom, there we go. Now you will earn money really fast. So in this uh, last round, you will see now that you will have a lot of money. For this round, you want the map, of course. It's really, really strong, like this. Uh, you can also start to build some... Uh, you're gonna build a village here, now we need this path and this path. This is nice. Um, if you press S on your keyboard, if you are playing on PC, you can easily just do this. There you go. Now we have this one. You can buy another one right there. Another one. I think it should be enough. <laughs> yeah, I like this. Yeah. Now you're gonna get these super mines. And you can also buy another sweet monkey right there. Like this. Oops. <laughs> this. This. And get that really fast down. Recreate this again. And we can now upgrade this too. And I say we could easily get the Homeland Defender now, so we get even more attack speed, so we're gonna do that. I will just have one tech bot currently for this tower. You see the game is much faster than as well. So we're gonna get another. And we're also gonna build another tower like here. Like this. And we're gonna have another. Like this. Good. Yeah, there. You can also drag them out if you really want to. Like this. It's actually up to you, whatever you feel for, like there. Um. I'm gonna slow it a little bit down because we're gonna get this monkey, this one, and we also want this guy, and we want this one, and this one. Now you can speed it up again, and you can also place one super monkey here. You can, if you want to, to be on the safe side, put this here, and get the bottom path, like this. And you can go to your tower right here and place this with the exit. Like this. So you will basically be safe anyways. Yeah. So with uh, this you should be good to go with this. Well, we have so much damage here that it's impossible to not win this. <laughs> Reactivating this one. Just keep spamming your abilities. Here you can spam this. This did not travel into his next zone. As you see, we don't have the Ray of Doom here either, so it will be like this. Alright, like this. Okay, now is it done? And uh, now you can just save up money here for last round. 
and the real boss is appearing. And that's a uh, one struggle if you are not sure what to do. I did uh, at least feel on it. I'm gonna turn on that to start now so I don't forget. Okay, so the next fun part we're gonna do now is to uh, sell everything, basically. Or at least not everything, but we're gonna sell the most. This, this, this. Is it a shortcut for selling? I hope it is. Backspace. Oh, interesting. Yeah, thank you. Right. So the next thing we're gonna do is to uh, put this one here. Uh, no, we put this one here. And the next thing we want to do here is to... Max upgrade this, and then we're gonna turn it into a crazy sand tower, right? And we're gonna do it again, around here, again, do the same thing, like this, um, boom. And we can spawn one more, maybe we will get this in range, I don't know, I'm not sure, but we're gonna have one more. So then we're gonna place another engineer monkey here and do it like this. Alright, so we got the uh, we're gonna place a lot of this around the map. It will be like this. And then you can do this and this and this and this. Stuff like this. Yeah, it will be like something like this. And um, yeah, whatever. I could let it be here, but whatever. Okay, let's start it. And now it should work to melt this down. Melting it like nothing. It's a little bit laggy, but it works. I can also get some more here as well. You see the little screen getting yellow here. I'm sorry if this guide wasn't good enough, because this was my first uh, boss guide, basically. The first boss guide to show you how to beat the elite boss. And Lunaris is the easiest one, anyways. Um, yeah, this was really, really nice. Ooh, what? Spike Factory was the monkey star <laughs> and it's not a in fact it's not a monkey thank you so much for watching guys and make sure to leave a comment down below and make sure to hit the subscribe button and like the video and thank you so much for watching